But what we've got here today is one of these situations. I lived my whole life with two contrary kind of conflicting fears. One of which is um, that everybody else is going to do their homework, which is what happened today. <laughs> the, the overwhelming fear is that I'm going to actually do the homework, and that day we're going to go in, and the teacher's going to say, you know, just as a special present, you guys don't have to turn in your homework. <laughs> Now, when that happens, I'm ready for them. <laughs> and I was listening to uh, Richard and Gail. First of all, it's a real pleasure. I've never read Richard before. Uh, but back when I won the National Book Award, there was about, oh, I think it was about a week and a half when people were paying attention to what I said. And I got asked a lot, and I'd never um, passed up a chance to say, you know, you've got a, you know, Richard hadn't won the Pulitzer then, and I, you know, I, I said, you know, you've got to read this guy's novels about New York because they're just, um, I mean, New York Times asked me a year ago or something for the my best book of the last 25 years, and I said, straight man. And it's not fun. Well, that's the, the guy at New York Times laughed. But I said, no, I'm serious. Um, I mean, to me, the first thing a novel should do is entertain. And um, uh, there's, that's the most entertaining book ever written, uh, as far as I'm concerned. It's, uh, I, can st yeah. I can still just bring tears to my eyes reading that up. And strangely enough, I also find myself up here with Gail Collins. Now, there is another columnist for the Times named Maureen Dowd. I got that right, right? Okay, Maureen Dowd hit the, you know, when she started the columnizing, I was still doing a little of that myself. Um, I was up on this island where we live in the Puget Sound, uh, right now, a syndicated column. And I didn't have very many papers, but among them was one of the Seattle papers. So I'd heard about Maureen Dowd and then forgot her name and picked up the paper and read a column by Gail Collins and then wrote my column that week and said, Maureen Dowd is the best columnist in the country. <laughs> and then, I can't remember the name of the PI, what does that stand for? The Seattle Post Intelligence here, yeah. Well, they fired me that week and picked up Maureen Dowd. There is a compliment in there for you somewhere. 